This is part of a video series around my small bathroom remodel process. And in this video, I go to Ikea to take a look at a couple of bathroom sinks in person. After searching the internet, I learned that Ikea has the best deals for bathroom sinks. You can find cheaper sinks that range about $50 to $100 in stores like Home Depot. But at this price range, they're the ones made out of faux faux marble, which I think looks plasticky and I hate them. If you want it, want white glazed porcelain sinks you have to pay about a couple of hundred dollars even in stores like home depot or lowe's but at ikea you can get them for around a hundred dollars and i was looking for sinks that were around 19 inches by 24 inches this is the sink that i like the best so this is here's another display of the same sink that i like best and ended up purchasing for my bathroom it was around $90 plus tax um, and it comes in three different sizes and the one that fit my vanity was the smallest size you can see how the sink I got looks in my bathroom by going and watching the before and after video of my remodel bathroom the link to that video is in the description box below This one is cheaper, it's only around $78, but when I saw it in person, I just didn't like it. It didn't have the clean lines like the other one, and it looked a bit old-fashioned. This is the third model, and what's really nice about this one is that it has splash guards on the back and on the sides so that things like toothbrush or toothpaste will not fall off if you have it on the sink. The price of this one was $100 plus tax. Now I'm just showing you a selection of different vanities and sinks they have at Ikea. Just walking down. And yeah, you've got a selection of gray and cream colored vanities. And some um, smaller sinks. and some dark dark wood colored vanities this one is very interesting looking the white the white one that's got like a three-dimensional pattern And then now we are going to this section with some teeny tiny tiny sinks. It's really hard to tell how tiny they actually are in the video, but they're really small and really cute. And I wish I had a teeny tiny bathroom to remodel so I could um, purchase one of these or I'd have a reason to get one of these. They were so cute. Now here's the process for getting your merchandise. There are no shelves with merchandise here in the showroom. You have to go to the self-service furniture pickup area, which is the warehouse where the merchandise are stored. And this red tag shows you, shows you where your stuff will be located. So my sink will be in aisle 14, bin 34. The worst part of shopping at Ikea was that this store was this maze of different showrooms and display rooms and marketplace that you had to walk through before um, you could get to the warehouse to pick up the product, pay for, pay for it and exit the building. So Ikea strategically forces you to walk through their entire store, whether you, you want to or not. And there wasn't a way to bypass having to go through all these 
rooms, there were um, these shortcuts um, to the self-service warehouse, but they really weren't shortcuts. I mean, there were arrows for shortcuts, they, but re they really weren't. And that was really annoying because I just wanted to buy my sink and get out, but I couldn't. Um, and so overall, I'd say that I got a nice sink and a, at a good price, but I would I don't know if I would um, recommend shopping at Ikea. I'd only recommend Ikea to folks who are young, have lots of energy and free time and are looking to save money. And for me, I think I'm just too old for it. And here is... Um, my sink in aisle 14, bin 34.